Okay? There's something special about your family. There's something special about my family. But we can always uh, learn and pick from these words. Are we together? Okay. Um, the first need of a man in marriage is respect. I've said that again and again. Respect. Wives, you want to have the best of your husband, do what? I can't hear you. Respect him. Even if, he's, even if you are older than him in age, the moment you agree to marry that man, he becomes your what? Your head. Nobody works with his head. We are the head. Are you hearing me? See, they are not talking now. You may have more finance than your husband. You may have more contact, more whatever. It doesn't matter. That man is your head. Mama Gulenu is talking. You are talking three, four times. That's not how to respect a man. We, some husbands help end up slapping their wives, which I'm not in support of because the man said one thing, the woman had said 25 things. We know you can talk, but please, you should mind how you talk. Huh? We know you can talk, but please, you should also note what you say. Is that clear? The fact that we can talk. Hey, mama said we can talk, so let me talk. Only your body. Which I'm not in support of. Am I balancing it? But then you must know what you say. The man wants respect, okay? You respect him in your words. The way you talk to him. Sorry now. Okay, baby, I'm sorry. Sorry now. Ah. Is it different? Talk to me. Is it different? Very different. Please respect him. Respect him. Respect him. Respect him. If a man is not getting the respect he needed from his wife, he feels less than a man. A man that can't retaliate. You understand? A man that can't retaliate, that can't beat, that can't talk. Uh, when you disrespect him, you are devaluing him. You are talking him down. Are you getting woman? He, he keeps going back to his share. And God forbid he find a lady that will speak well to, to him. Then he will react more to that one. Don't think every man has the capacity to withstand every temptation. So the one God has given to you, keep him well. I'm not saying be a CID. Okay, respect him in your words. In the way you serve his food, Res let, let there be respect with his food. You don't serve your husband food with the same plate everybody eats with. Am I, I'm talking as a man. Oh. This is the common plate everybody in the house uses. And I'm also using the common plate. So what separates me from... Are you getting what I'm saying? What separates me from the rest? The way you serve him, uh, um, like I said, because you have grown up children does not mean your children will be the only ones serving your husband. You should do that. That's your primary job. She said, even though our food is not sweet, you should, we should appreciate it. We should manage. But go and learn. No. Am I balancing? Uh, if you have been managing for three years, it's too much. Since we married three years, you still don't know how to cook. 